Hey guys, welcome to Bass Kicking Outdoors. I am so excited for this video. Um, I had a subscriber suggest and ask if I could do this video, and this is one of my first subs subscriber suggestion videos, and so I'm, I'm, I'm pumped. Uh, I want to do a shout out to Grant Campbell. Um, he suggested doing this video, or asked if I could do it, and uh, shout out to him for suggesting it. But we are doing Mystery Tactical Box versus Fishing Care Package. Now, you pick up the Fishing Care Package at Academy. And, um, and that's where I've seen them, and that's where I picked this one up at. And I picked up the Mystery Tackle Box um, on mysterytacklebox.com. And we are going to compare these two. And I'm excited. I want to get in here and see exactly what each one has. And uh, let you guys know my opinion um, if the fishing care package kind of lives up to being able to compete with Mystery Tackle Box. I don't know. Um, so let's dive in and see, see what's happening. All right, guys, so let's dive in to the fishing care package from Academy Sports, or picked up at Academy Sports. It's from fishingcarepackage.com. So, first thing I notice is this Rapala DT. Um, it is a, swims to the depth of 10 feet, um, long casting, rattling crankbait. Pretty sweet looking, so that's a good value. Um, I looked up the values on these and this bait right here um, is valued at $7.29 um, I found on a website. Next is River to Sea. Now if you guys remember, River to Sea was the headline in the November Monster Bass Box. Um, they did a uh, lipless crankbait in that box. This looks to be like some type of... Um, Jerk bait with a crankbait type lip. Um, it's a suspending bait, and I'm just not sure. It says the action is zero to eight feet, um, but I looked on their website. I could not find this particular lure. So I don't know if this is like a discontinued item. Um, I couldn't find it anywhere online. Um, they don't really have a name on it. It's kind of interesting packaging, um, but I found something that was pretty similar. And it was right around the $16 range. So that's, they're adding a lot of value into the box there, or at least claiming a lot of value is what I would say. Um, they do on the outside of the box claim that there's 40 plus dollars worth of value. Um, and I'll go over, over you, I will go over that with you guys and tell you whether that's true or not based on looking at things online. Next is the O. Shognesi um, Mustad Hooks. Um, five aught in size. Um, these were valued around um, five dollars and thirty cents. There's eight hooks in there, so it's a pretty good size pack. Um, not necessarily the hooks I would normally go with. They're bronze, and um, they're a straight hook. I usually like to kind of a, a bend, a different type of bend on them. Um, usually in offsets, so I usually go with a lot. But anyways, um, next is the Fish Head Fish Head Dude, quarter ounce. Um, this thing is weird. I'll show you guys close-ups of all this stuff, and, like always. But this has got, I'll read this to you guys. Um, it says the Fish Head Spin, the Weedless Fish Head Spin, the Fish Head Dude, and the Fish Head Shaker may be used with many soft plastic trailers, including fluke style, paddle tail, and curly tail baits. But it's got this head on it. It's pretty interesting. It's like a shield. Anyways, those actually come in at around $6 in value for those. Then we have Lunker Hunt, the Bento Baits. Um, these came out a while, a while ago. Um, they were an iCast winner when they did come out. Um, they are $7.99, so got a lot of value in those right there. Pretty interesting looking. And then we got the Rage Tail um, Rage Baby Menace. Um, I love Rage Tail Soft Plastic, so that's a good value right there. And that comes in at $5.29 on the uh, cheapest place that I found it. A lot of, like Academy, I think it's around seven bucks or six or seven bucks for those. Um, 
anyways, stop fiddling with this thing, get this fixed up. And then uh, last but not least in the box for the fishing care package, they give you a $10 uh, coupon to go on to fishingcarepackage.com and purchase something for $10 off. All right, so the FC, FCP fishing care package, I brought it in at around $48. So it's right around, um, and, and that really depends on how much the river to sea um, is valued at online. I could not find that particular bait. And so, um, you know, I think that it, you know, right around the $40 range is probably, probably the correct, you know, I, I, I found $48 worth of stuff, but maybe that was a discontinued bait and it was going for 12 or something. That's, that's quite possible. And so it'd be more around 42, um, but a lot of value in the box. Now, what is it stuff that I love? Um, I love the rage tails, um, the, the lunker hunt. I've not really tried before or seen before, so I'll have to try those out. The fish heads are kind of weird, but I mean, it's always fun to try new stuff. Um, I think it would be um, pretty decent value, pretty decent value for 20 bucks. So the fishing care back package is 20 bucks at Academy. Um, they have a $30 version as well. This one was 20. Let's dive into the mystery tackle box. Now, the mystery tackle box I got is I got their base version because um, $16.99 was closest to the 20. I figured it was the best um, kind of price comparison. And so let's dive into Mystery Tackle Box and see what they got. Now, um, I'm gonna go over the values with, with you on this, and then I'm also gonna kinda do a comparison if you have actually a Shop Carl's um, membership, because some of the baits you could get on Shop Carl's and get actually cheaper, and so the box would be um, kinda valued differently, I would say, based off of retail value and Shop Carl's value. Right off the bat, we have Mustad Hooks. Now, there's only two hooks in here, and so some people, you know, and, and I've said it before, I don't love, I don't love their um, 16.99 version because you do get smaller packs of things. They do adjust for the value, but um, you know, I think that these hooks are probably, you know, pretty cheap. Um, two hooks. It'd be cool if they had a few more hooks in there. Um, those are the Mustad Offset Worm hooks. And as far as I can see. Um, they valued them at $1.50, which is like 75 cents a piece. If you got a pack of five, they were right around four to five dollars. So they're right in the right range. It's hard to actually find this particular hook online. Um, it's the Ultra Point. Um, and so I I'm not sure I, when I typed in the actual um, item number, part number, whatever you call it, I could not have find the exact one um, that was for sale on like a normal website like Tackle Warehouse or something like that. Um, next up is the Perfection Lures um, Shaky Head. This is a pretty interesting little um, hook and, and shaky head. And I, I like it. It's, st it's a stand up jig. And so it's made to um, kind of stand up once it hits the ground um, in the water. And um, it's pretty sweet. That um, value wise is. $5.99 according to Mystery Tackle Box, and I brought it in at, um, let's see here, shaky head, $5.50. And so I think they valued that 50 cents higher than what you can buy it um, at online. And so I think I picked that one up at Tackle Warehouse, I believe, um, or checked it out at Tackle Warehouse. Next thing is the Big Bites Baits um, Swimming Crawl um, in Hematoma. I believe that's the color. Um, this right here is five, 349 and they valued at 349 on their card and so I think they're right on with those. Then next is the Bubonic Bugs Square Bill. Um, Chris Grout, um, which is a well-known bait designer, um, partnered with Catch Co and uh, created this square bill. Um, it's a pretty look, pretty cool looking square bill, pretty cool looking paint job. They've been selling these for the past three or four months, I believe. Um, I have like two or three of them, I think now. Um, but anyways, I don't think I've had a chance to try them yet. And uh, but they're definitely very interesting looking, very good looking. Um, definitely worth a try, I think. They value these at eleven ninety nine, um, and you can pick those up at Shop Carl's for eleven ninety nine. You can also actually you can pick them up for ten bucks right now. 
um, retail value. They have them on discount. And if you're a Shop Carl's member, you can pick them up for seven right now. They normally go for nine as a Shop Carl's member. Um, they got them instead of 30% off, they're like 42% off. Last but not least is the Carl's Amazing Baits um, Flicker Worm. Pretty cool looking worm. Um, very interesting looking color, I like it. Um, the, they value those at $3.99 and uh, if you picked them up with a Shop Carl's membership, they'd be $2.40 though. So that brings the total of this box's value according to them, according to their card, is $26.96. According to, um, if you take the uh, Perfection Lures, which is the shaky head thing here, um, at $5.49 instead of $5.99, your value is actually you know, $26.46. But if you take into account that, and you have a Shop Carl's membership, you could actually go out and purchase this box for around $21.89. So for $16.99, you're still getting a little bit more bang for your buck. Um, in terms of what's in the box this, this month, I really do like it. Um, I think the shake heads are pretty sweet looking, pretty, pretty interesting. Uh, definitely worth a try. Um, must add hooks. I mean, they're good offset worm hooks. I like, I like that style. Um, and this crawl from Big Bite Bait, you can't beat that. Um, you know, it's a cheaper, you know, you can grab those all, all day for around, you know, three, three dollars, like three, four dollars at Academy. Um, but good stuff, they make good stuff. And then Shop Carl's, uh, this Flicker Worm, I've not tried it yet. I think I have a couple packs of these um, that I've gotten in some boxes over the last few months, but um, definitely, definitely look a pretty good worm. Um, and then I've definitely been wanting to try this um, bubonic. Um, square bill crankbait. Um, anyways, a good value, I think. Probably one of my favorite $16.99 boxes um, that I've had for a while. Um, how do they compare, though, to each other? Do you get more m for the money? Yes. You get more for the money. You get over $40 worth of the value. If you go online and purchase these baits, you would spend around $48. Um, you know, 40 to $48, and you're getting that for 20 bucks. Um, so obviously the value is great. Does that mean I love this more than this mystery tackle box? <sighs> it's to each their own. What baits that come in it? This had a Rapala in it. Maybe the next um, one I grab is gonna have some baits that I, I love even more. Um, if I open this back up, I do, I think the river to sea is actually pretty interesting. I'll show you guys a close up of that um, as I talk here, but I think the river to sea is is pretty interesting looking bait, and um, I, you know I don't know about quality, but um, I have liked I like their uh, um, not square bill, but their lipless crankbait I got in the monster bass box in November. Um, Rapala, you know name brand can't beat that, you can't beat that. Oh, so it's a good stuff, but Rage Tails, you know I think there's a lot of great value in here. I'm not I'm not a huge fan of these fish heads. I think. They're just kind of crazy looking. Uh, I'm not saying they don't work, but I, I don't know. Not my favorite thing. And not my favorite type of hooks, but um, good brand. So I would say the value is definitely there. Um, and I would say that Mystery Tackle Box did bring it, but they don't. you're not going to get $40 worth of stuff for a $16.99 box. You just got to understand that. You're going to get somewhere between $21 you know, and $26 worth of value. Um, and going into it, you have to be okay with that. And if you are, then go for it. Um, if you want a little bit more bang for your buck, you know, I think that the fishing care package is pretty cool. Um, this one had a decent amount of stuff. I'm not, you know, I, these Lunker Hunt bento baits, you know, I, it's not going to be my favorite type of fishing. Um, it's more of a drop shot type of uh, little worm or a little uh, bait there. And, um, you know, I love drop shot, but. Um, I don't do it a lot, and so it's just going to depend on that and how much you value those things. I think with any box, you know, there's going to be months that it's good and you are like, heck yeah, and it, it, to you, it's very good baits that you like, um, and if it's new to you, you still might like them, but sometimes when they're new to you, you're like, Ugh, what the heck is this, or sometimes they're novelty type baits. Um, but I would say both of these boxes are pretty good and are definitely worth a try. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for all your support. I appreciate it. Shout out again to Grant Campbell for 
um, for this idea of doing this comparison video. And uh, as always, guys, I just thank you. Please hit that subscribe button. Please hit the like button. And as always, I'll catch you guys next time.